enjoy and say hi to the community and remind them that their neighbors ride bikes, their neighbors have a good time, their neighbors cross the street, and we just want to be safe. The St. Pat's for All Parade is a wonderful exploration of political causes um, in the neighborhood, and it has the neighborhood vibe, and everyone's wearing green. And we are here to bring a positive message. Sunnyside, Queens, all of Queens supports safer walking and safer biking on Skillman and 43rd Avenue. And I think a lot of people who are on the sidelines cheering the party goers are going to love the fact that we are bringing this discussion here. Sunnyside and Woodside has a chance to really advance towards safer streets. Here on 43rd Avenue and Skillman Avenue, uh, protected bike lanes would make the streets so much safer, pedestrian islands would make the streets safer, shorter crosswalks. It would be wonderful for working cyclists, for commuters, and also for people who, who use it as a recreation to connect to Manhattan, to go to Central Park, or to connect to any other park in Queens. I very often do my shopping in Sunnyside on my way home, and uh, I bring my kids to Sunnyside. And um, now that they're teenagers, I need them to be able to bike safely on protected bike lanes. I live in Jackson Heights and I bike to work on Skillman and 43rd Avenue every day. Look at a bike map of Western Queens. There's no other safe way for me to get to the Queensboro Bridge. I want to be safe on my way to work and I want to be safe for my son here to ride his bike around the neighborhood. We need structural improvements and we need protected bike lanes. When we have protected bike lanes, uh, we can ride we're more relaxed. We don't have to worry so much about getting doored, about people driving into us. Almost a year ago, Palacio Reyes, an immigrant in this city, a hardworking delivery cyclist, was killed by a reckless driver. And a week later, a cyclist died at the same intersection. And the community really recognized that this was a moment where we all needed to come together for safety. We needed to come together to improve the infrastructure here. Uh, and we called for protected bike lanes. We called for safer crosswalks for pedestrians. And when you get two miles down the road that way, you hit a beautiful protected bike lane that gets you into Manhattan. If you go a mile the other direction, you hit Queens Boulevard, which is a game changer for Queens. And this is the missing link, and this is what DOT needs to make really a cycling kind of super highway that leads deep into Queens and gets people safely into Manhattan. We also want them to know that they can do something about it and that there are people who are doing something about it. That's why we're here.